Welcome back to One Hour Limit Locked, where I race to complete some of RuneScape's most iconic challenges, whilst limited to just one hour of gameplay each day. In Season 1, we got ourselves a fire cape in 46 days, and in Season 2, we achieved Barrow's Gloves in just another 38. But now, in Season 3, it's time for our toughest challenge yet. The question is, how many days will it take us to complete our first ever raid on the account? We not only have to get ourselves geared and leveled up just to step inside a raid, we then have to complete it in under one hour, as logging out in the middle will end our run. I've no idea how long this is going to take me, but I can't wait to find out, so join me for the journey here in Season 3 of One Hour Limit Locked, as we become a Tomb Raider. What's good everyone and welcome back once again. It is day 54 here on our third season of the show and we are going to be getting straight on into it with our birdhouse run as normal. I think after that I have decided I am going to continue with my farming runs, at least for the moment, unless people get really sick of them and you tell me to stop. So... I'm going to carry on, but I'm going to do it with Toad Flax, because it's super cheap. It's like 500 GP a seed. And right now, it's third on the list of profit behind Avento and Quam, which we can't make. I think it was Quam, or it might have been Canteen. Either way, we can do them. So it's third on the list right now. It's always generally in the top portion because you use them to make Sardomin brews and yet the seeds are super cheap in comparison to like all other herb seeds that get used frequently. So I'm just going to keep doing the toad flax. It'll basically mean that our seed costs are non-existent rather than paying 25k or an R seed six times a day, you know, or we'll just have the profit from them without actually having to spend anything next to nothing anyway. So that's the plan. Should have got two of these so I could go to Barrock first. Oh well. And then yeah, we'll be back off to the zombies to see if we can get ourselves level 75 magic. I don't see any reason not to just go straight on ahead and finish off our goal uh, thing. That's everything other than the seeds. Okay, so let's see. I will just check the Avento to see what the price of them is. Yeah, see, it's this is the price my calculator used, but this is the actual price, which is much higher for some reason. So... Like, it's not even... The Toad Flax would actually be a better profit. All right, I'm just going to get 10 days worth. Because 35k for 10 days worth, you know. Okay, we'll, uh, we'll put the offer up ever so slightly. Really? Even my Toad Flax aren't buying now. The fuck? Oh, there we go. They all just bought. Never mind. Cancel that. Enough of them bought, anyway. Right, off we go. Yeah, we may not quite need to spend the full day at the zombies again, which may mean we get a few minutes at the end to start considering doing some of the other odd jobs, depending, like, I went through the list of things that I want to do yesterday, but it depends how much time we have left before I figure out what we're going to actually do with the time, if we have any. Speaking of time, I timed today's episode's recording very poorly because... It is currently 20 to 4, which means that I am going to miss 420 entirely. Oh, I got myself set up and ready to record, and then I looked at the time, and thought, fuck it, I'm already set up now. I didn't bring any teleports again. It's the second day in a row. God damn, we're going to be edge Voltellian again, aren't we? See, these are like 4k each, which is damn near the same as Avantos. They're like 600 GP or less than Avantos. And Avantos cost 6k a seed rather than 500 GP a seed. It's just silly. Like, I don't get why Toad Fox are so cheap, but they always have been. And maybe it's just like a super common thing on drop tables. I don't really know, because it's a lower level herb. Maybe people get their toad flax from other sources than farming usually, so the herbs are in low demand. I think, to be honest, probably if we do have time left at the end of the day, we'll just go to miscellanea. Oh, dead patch? Come on. And I actually don't know what fishing we can do on miscellanea. Like, what tool we need. I'm gonna have to Google that while I do a different patch. Tuna, lobsters, or swordfish? Are they all harpoon? I think they're harpoon, aren't they? Yeah, harpoon. Cage harpoon. Okay. 
Yeah, because if we can just... We were almost at that 50 fishing that we'll need for the barbarian training. So if we can squeeze that out at miscellanea when we're topping up our favor, then that'd be sick. Okay, let's get some chaos. A couple thousand. I'm probably selling back whatever we don't use anyway, but we're starting with 1,000. Okay, I'm going to get a bunch of water as well. Uh, no, we're only on 12 mil. We've gone down a mil. How much have we got now? 3,000 chaos, 2, 6, death. No, we need twice as much chaos as death. So we need 5, 2, 2,000 more. Okay, I think I'm also going to put an offer in for a Hasta in case it doesn't insta-buy. I'm going to put it at 4, 7, 5, uh... Oh, it insta bought and then dragon crossbow i just want to get this stuff on the account as soon as i know we're gonna use it that's fine okay that's another two pieces of red gear get those tagged get that drawn out and removed look at that wow it's so tiny isn't it right now we're gonna go back to the bursting off we go how many axes do you reckon we'll get today then folks one axe two axe Three axe, four, five axe, six axe, seven axe, eight. What are we saying? Well, we're expecting our magic level in 30 minutes. Saying 40 for the defense level, so it might be worth staying just a little bit longer, but we don't really need extra magic levels above 75. I mean, if we're up to 78, we could upgrade our trident, which would be reasonable. But 78 is a long way away. It's definitely not something I think we need for entry level mode we can always finish off the defense at scurious to be fair we could probably finish it just with lamps but from scurious i prefer to get it done first so that we can use piety for our last two attack levels it looks like we lost aggro we are very close towards the end of a trip anyway we've almost got a full invent so okay i'm just gonna call out that Oh, I don't have any lobsters left. So I'll take a Karam one. I mean, it's one Karam one. It's not really uh, going to break the bank, is it? <laughs> I keep clearing them too fast, man. Having to wait for respawns. Looks like our aggro just ran out. We got full inventory anyway, and our prayer is running down. About 14 minutes left to get our magic level. Don't die. Maybe I should just leave. Bit of a close one there. Nothing eventfuls happened so far, no. Nothing crazy at all. No axes, no nasty deaths that came from nowhere. I don't know. Slow day, guys. We're almost done, though. I'm hoping this is our last trip right now out to the Armored Zombos. Our very, very last trip. Maybe we'll need it to make it two, but... I don't know. Sometimes we get longer trips. Depends on the drops. Oh, I feel like I'm going to have to make another trip on. Oh, there's still seven minutes on the clock and we've almost got a full invent. Oh, I might have invent space. I guess an irrit leaf's not worth as much as a qualm. Okay, we're going to have to reset anyway. Should be able to pick that back up when we return. We are very almost there though, just four minutes on the clock. To be honest, I could probably out the rest of the way, but I feel like I just want to get it done at this point. Alright, this is for sure our last trip out to the Armored Zombies, y'all. The grind is almost over, do not worry. We almost got to 75 hit points as well. That's not bad at all. The defense is a bit further away still, but we can finish that off quickly enough at Scurry as we're getting our attack levels. I reckon two days of melee training, plus a couple days on bits and bobs, quests and requirements and shit, but not long at all now. We'll probably be a bit overgeared for entry level, to be honest, but that's fine, because we'll still be underleveled compared to what you would like to be. Also, can we get some Fs in chat for the 420 that just happened that I missed? Like, now? If I'm awake, 
I don't miss 420. If I'm away during 420, I hit it. Every time. So this is weird. Like, my body just knows when it's time. I felt myself moving, and then I was like, no, nope, there's 11 minutes on the clock. You can't move. Oh, look at that beautiful timing with my prayer as well. Let's go. That is the 75 magic done. We're going to get straight on out of here. We've got eight minutes left on the clock. We may as well make use of it. Very nice indeed. I have another thing crossed off the list. We can now wield our trident of the seas that we bought a couple weeks ago. Look at that bad boy. Boom, bada boom, bada boom. Let's go. And we are going to go to miscellanea i have a wealth apparently but before we go to miscellanea we would probably like to change our spell book we need a harpoon as well we want our coins and i think that's it just get some stamina in case so quickest way i know to revert my spell book i don't have lunas so it would be cis and then We'll run over to Tiss. Not the Dark Altar. Sorry, victim. And we'll swap on to that one. And then back puts us on normal. Run back over to the Fairy Ring. It's about as close as going to the RD one. Take ourselves over to Miscellanea. Oh, it feels good being on the normal spellbook again. It's so weird being on Ancients because I'm just constantly like thinking, oh, I can do this, I can do that. And then like, oh, no, I'm on Ancients. Fuck that tree. Please tell me I don't need a cage. Okay, thank fuck. Six actions. Ooh, maybe we can get it. Depends if it goes up I want it every time. Sandwiches. Bread roll. Kind of shit. This is so slow. And there is our 50 fishing level. Still need a couple more approval points though, so we got there. Just fine. It's taken a couple minutes though. Don't think we're going to have any time once we're done in miscellanea here. We may as well go and claim our collections while we're here. And by the time we've done that, the clock's going to be out. But we can now boost to 55 with an Admiral Pie, which is exactly the level we need to complete the Barbarian Fishing Training. And we have to do the Fishing Training before Otto will allow us to do the Smithing Training, which is what we actually want for the Zamorokian Hasta. We don't have to do the fire making section, so that's good because that section is long and sucks. I don't know if I've ever completed it because it's just like, eh, basically where we're at. I think I have time to do a bird house run maybe. I might just be able to squeeze a bird house run in. Lovely stuff. Oh no, I should just go to the GE and put all that shit up and the stuff we got today. I guess we can sell our runes off as well now. Because we've already got charges in the trident, so we don't really need our runes. Okay, I'm not actually going to get any of this up for sale. I just wanted to actually get it all in my inventory so I could have it there ready for tomorrow. Yeah! What's all, what does this add up to? Let's have a look at how much money is there. About 1.6 mil. Not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. We'll be able to add that to our existing 6 mil. We've got the full 7.5 in miscellaneous, so about 13.5 expendable income at the minute plus we got the zamorokian hasta and the dcb today honestly i think our gear is pretty much set now we need a mage cape still and i think that's it i think that's all we need the mage cape which we can now get now that we have 75 and then a couple levels to be able to wield this thing yeah we're pretty good to go honestly two more attack levels a tiny bit to get this defense level and then our requirements. That's all that's left, folks. All that is left will be in raids before you know it. If you're excited to see that happen, make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it. And if you're not excited to see that happen, sort yourself out, mate. You should be. It's going to be epic. Yeah. Hit that like button because you know it's going to be epic. And I missed 420 to record this for you. So you know that you owe me one big fat like as a result. I am going to go and roll myself a spliff now, 13 minutes too late. And you are going to remember to look after yourself, to be lovely to each other. And I'll see you on the next one.